Welcome back, and thanks so much for sticking with us here on Fox 24 News and Live. We have Steve Lassuer with the Odessa Police Department, and we also have Sergeant Gary Dusler. He's with the Ector County Sheriff's Office, and we're so happy that you're here this morning. We're going to talk about busting for badges, and um, that's a clay sheet event that's coming up, and it's going to benefit you guys in law enforcement that right. really need those extra funds to help with different well, things that you need at the department. Right. We use it to buy like vests, laptops for the. Uh, you know, the vehicles and stuff like that, also mm -hmm. for tasers, just funds that we normally may not have had to, to purchase those items. Right, right. And how important is having this event out here in West Texas for you guys? It's, it's very important. You know, uh, you know, like, it's one of the fundraisers that not only the Odessa Police Department, but Hector County, Millen County, Millen PD, we depend on every year. Mm -hmm. uh, last year, each agency made $85,000. And so, you know, like you said, we, we, uh, we really depend on it because it helps pay for for much needed equipment. Right, and we know you guys are out here from Odessa, but these funds are actually split evenly, I think, among multiple law enforcement right. agencies. They are, they're so split it supports way more than just this area. Midland and Odessa law enforcement. Mm -hmm. And uh, so it, it, it benefits all of us. It gets everybody together. Uh, that's what we like about it is the camaraderie. Yeah. Uh, you know, we have such uh, popularity this year. We've had to actually add a rotation Oh, yeah. uh, which has really been good for us. Now we have a uh, Thursday at 2.30, we have some, I think about 100 slots left. Okay. So if they want to get hold of uh, OPD or any of the agencies, uh, they can call us and we can, we can get them signed up for that. Right. But that's, that's very encouraging for us. I know, that. and I remember last time you had a couple of spots left for the Friday slot, but since then that slot's sold out. Oh yeah, so, it's gone. Yeah, I it's mean, gone. people have to really take advantage of the spots right. that are left. Um, so where can people register if they're, if they're still looking to get involved in this? Yeah, they can just go to bustingforbadges.org. Okay. So. Perfect. And around, how much does that cost? It's a four-man team, right? Yeah, That's it's a four-man team. team. Uh -huh. It's roughly you know, $640, I believe, for a four-man team. You okay. can do individual shooters, but the vast majority of the shooters are, are done in, in teams of four. So. Nice. That's perfect. And I know outside of Busting for Badges, you also have a dinner coming up. It's a special event and people can actually have their teams announced at this dinner. Um, mm -hmm. There's going to be food and entertainment. So that sounds like it's pretty fun. When's that happening? Yeah, that's next Thursday at okay. 7 30 p.m. at the Horse Show Arena in Midland. Okay. And so for those who don't want to shoot but still want to be involved and help out, uh, support us, they can sign up to, to attend that concert dinner. The State Land Band is going to be performing right. at it. Uh, so we have tables of eight and tables of four. So. And you also have raffle tickets that yes. you're trying to give away as well. They're $20 and you can contact pretty much all the agencies and we can get you hooked up. No problem. Call, it. Call us. Yeah. We'll just take care of it. And those prizes are actually pretty cool. We'll have more information on our website and on Fox 24 News' Facebook page after the show. But thank you so much for being in our thank studio you. this morning. Thanks for having us. You guys are awesome. All right. Well, we're going to take to a quick commercial break, but stay tuned for more news and weather. Here's Dirk with a quick look at that forecast before we get to that break.